Welcome to this short educational webcast. We've created it for your information and professional competence purposes. Watching this webcast should help inform your practice and improve your clinical effectiveness within this clinical situation. Remember, webcasts are not intended to be full training courses. However, they are intended to improve your confidence when dealing with similar situations. Finally, practitioners must only act in accordance with CPGs and their current scope of practice and status on the register. The Pediatric Assessment Triangle is a tool we use as a hands-off approach for the initial assessment of children. Um, and it's a valuable tool to get started with to observe the child in their natural environment before we um, proceed with a more um, in-depth examination. So it consists of three components, um, the first one being the appearance, uh, next being the work of breathing, and then the final part is the circulation to skin. Um, and by observing those three elements, we get a very good overview of our initial impression of a, a, ch a child. To start with, we look at the overall appearance. Um, this we observe from a distance, um, looking at the child in their environment that we find them. So we look for things like their interaction with others, um, whether they're, they have, have a well appearance, whether they look sick, um, whether they're quiet, playful, interactive, um, whether they're shy. Um, and all of this is a very useful tool in getting an initial assessment as to whether we're dealing with a sick child. The next as part of this assessment would be work of breathing, um, where we look at a child's um, respiratory status. That will include things like um, assessing recession, such as intercostal and subcostal recession, looking at tracheal tug, listening for noises such as grunting and strider and wheeze, um, also formally assessing their respiratory rate and measuring that and observing that they're able to talk um, and cry, which is a good sign that they're actually breathing. And then the third component of the triangle is circulation to skin. Uh, we look at things like their overall colour, whether they're nice and pink and well perfused, um, whether they're mottled, and then we will also look at things like whether how alert they are, which will tell us that they're perfusing their brain. So in my experience, the child that worries me when I'm doing an initial hands-off assessment is a child that's quiet, uh, uninteractive, maybe very clingy, um, very difficult to establish a rapport with, um, and overall generally looks quite miserable. Mm -hmm.